Well, up next, Coach Deshaun Bullitt is giving us some tips for hair loss prevention that you simply cannot miss. Mm. So this is Circle Live. We'll be right back. Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. We are here with our girl, Moni Love. She is filling in for our sister, Quad. And we all know, as women, hair loss is an issue that we know can affect so many women. Even Jada Pinkett Smith, she recently shared her yeah. experience. So let's take a look at that. Okay. Well, our next guest, she's here to help with the best ways to restore and re regrow our new hair. Okay. So please welcome the hair coach, Deshaun Bullard. Hi, Deshaun. Hi, hi. Hi, oh, hi, guys. Yeah. Thanks for having me. Thank you for coming. Yes. So, it's devastated. Yes. And it's devastated Get for women. Yeah. yeah. When we lose our hair. <laughs> right. So, what are some of the reasons we experience hair loss? Well, the first thing I want to say, I'm glad that Jada spoke out. Yes. Because so many African-American women are suffering in silence with hair loss. Mm -hmm. According to the American Academy of Dermatology, almost 30 million women are experiencing hair thinning and hair loss in the United States, but what's more alarming is a study that shows that almost half of African American women, about 40.9%, are suffering with alopecia, and we got to provide education. Wow. Yes. Those numbers are huge. Well, can you explain to us what alopecia is? Okay, so alopecia simply means hair loss mm -hmm. is what it means. There's so many different types of hair loss um, and, that I think that we'll be getting to. Ooh. Okay, um, as an African-American woman, what are some of the more common reasons for hair loss? Okay, so in African-American women, let's talk about the top four. Mm -hmm. Number one is traction alopecia. This is caused by us wearing the tight hairstyles, the braids, the weaves, and the wigs over an extended period of time. Okay. The pulling on the scalp causes hair loss. Then number two, we have postpartum hair loss, which I think... Uh, Toya Wright just talked about on social media. <laughs> right. After having a baby, your hair right. may start falling out. That's temporary. Then we have hormonal hair loss due to menopause, birth control, and then lastly, uh, hair loss due to the type of medications we take. Oh, yes. Pay attention to what your hair is saying. Yes. If you're taking medications, yes. Yes. talk to your doctor. They may be able to prescribe something different to stop the thinning in the hair Got loss. Got it. So is there anything we can do to prevent hair loss? So the number one thing to understand is that early detection is the key. Mm. As soon as your hair starts shedding, as soon as it starts breaking, go get help. Yeah. <laughs> Call your cosmetologist, trichologist, dermatologist, get help. Don't come to me after three years saying it's she falling said, out. don't come to me. Because that's what happens. <laughs> <laughs> Early detection is the key. Early detection. <laughs> All right. Most importantly, how do we regrow? Okay. So we regrow our hair by using new technology that I think we're going to go over here and yeah, talk about today. Yeah, I think today. we have uh, a little oh, guest here. Yeah. We have a little yeah. demo oh, to yes, show us how yes. we regrow our hair. Oh, yes. well, right I'm here for it yes. because I need it the most, I think. Come on with yes. the information. I feel like I have cradle cap on the top of my hair, so I need to find out <laughs> yeah. what we need to do to help regrow our hair. Yes, I, I think so. The first thing to understand about hair growth is God created your hair to grow. Okay. okay. So the reason why we're having so many problems with women, especially black women saying my hair is not growing, is that we're not taking care of our scalp. We have okay. too many scalp problems. But with this new device, Ooh. we have new technology that we can take a microscopic look at the scalp to determine oh. what's going on with the hair, what's going on with the scalp. She has a little dry scalp going on here, but even dry scalp over a period of time it's can cause that. hair loss. Yeah. That is that. So since we understand that hair loss is not a hair issue but a scalp issue, yeah. and thinning hair is not a scalp issue but a malnutrition strand issue, okay. I really wanted us to focus on the scalp. So I created mm -hmm. an acronym for scalp. Okay. Okay, so it? S, make sure we shampoo our hair. Mm -hmm. Trina Moni, we're not shampooing our hair anymore. I mean, we're wearing our weaves and we're trying to shampoo with the weave on and we're not getting proper scalp care. Mm -hmm. So use a shampoo that is mixture that is a mixture of sulfate and sulfate free. Okay. Okay, okay C, get a follicle checkup. Check up on your follicle. Can you actually do that? Go for a follicle checkup? Yes. See a trichologist, uh, a hair loss specialist, or even a dermatologist. Okay. Mm. Annually or biannually. A, assemble a team of professionals. Make sure you have in your contacts and your phone a licensed cosmetologist. Mm. No, nobody in the kitchen. A licensed <laughs> cosmetologist. I need you to stop. A trichologist <laughs> and a dermatologist. Okay. Yes. L, listen to what your hair is saying. Mm. If it's shedding, you may need a protein treatment. If it's dry, you may need uh, a steam hydration treatment. Okay. And then lastly, P, protect your hair at all costs. We wear protective costs, uh, protective styles uh, nowadays. Okay. That's a buzzword, but we're really not protecting it. Yes. We're actually causing more harm. Got well, it. I have a question for you. You know, a lot of times people tell us, as black women, as African-American women, not to shampoo your hair too often because it's very drying for us. Is that a misnomer? What is that? So what do we do? Okay, so shampooing your hair once every week, 
here every two weeks is okay, but shampooing, not shampooing your hair and going every three months because oh, no. you have oh. a, uh, a synthetic fiber in your hair or not shampooing your hair every six months because we're using a dry shampoo is bad. No, 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 no. But it's happening. When they over 20 years in my clinic, when women are losing their hair, who's doing that? You get you pay 300, 400 dollars to get your weed put in and it's synthetic. You're not shampooing your hair for three months. Oh no, it's a real hair. It's a real issue. Yeah. Well, see, when I was talking about credit cap, you know when you have babies and they have that one spot where the hair tends to kind of fall out. Yes. I have my hair is just like different textures in in different areas, but right here in this little cap area, it's kind of it's it's a little strong. So make sure uh, hair vitamins are a big thing right now, but just know that all hair vitamins are not created equal. Neurotrust, we have a hair vitamin that helps with thinning and hair loss. Okay. So if you're thinning, make sure you use a hair vitamin that can help with the thinning and the shedding and the breaking. Okay, what about with the edges? Because that's a huge problem in the African-American community. You know, because you can start with some edges, next you know, you get a little situation put in your hand, then your edges are all the way back here. Yes, that's that traction alopecia that we that's talked about. That's what I thought. You yeah. know, the pulling of the braids yeah. for yeah. an extended period of time. I'm not saying don't get the weave in your hair at all, but take it out. Allow your hair to breathe. I think people just forget, maybe. They get the, you know, get your braids and then get your uh, extensions put in and then you just forget. Like, okay, yeah. and just forget. I think you have to remember, like, I have real hair. Yes, yes. We don't Definitely. understand the science of hair, so it's it's really science. <laughs> yeah. You gotta keep it healthy. But Deshaun Bullard, thank you so much, because so many I of us have so much hair just now. I know, and we needed this information today, yeah. so thank you, thank you. I'm yeah. gonna get my follicles checked. Right. Yes. And up next, we're gonna hear from you and what the people say. We can get you in the slave. <laughs>